Zatei Herza. I am a fourth year journalism student. And yeah, I come from a small town in the Western Cape. Um, so sport reminds me about my family quite a lot because we watch it together most of the time or when we go watch any sport live, we go as a family together. So one thing that I have with me is this hoodie, this Formula One hoodie that my parents got for me on my birthday. And yeah, that's just one thing that reminds me of them. So my dad has this bad habit where you could be sitting on the couch and whenever he just comes in, he takes the remote and he switches the channel. You have no say. So normally on a Sunday, he would, after we have lunch together, he would come in and then he would change the channel and he would watch Formula One. And I didn't mind it. Like I didn't pay attention to it when I was a bit younger. But a few years ago, I just started watching and I was like, okay. And then like the next week came and I'm like, dad, are you putting the Formula One on now? And I just got into it through my dad. So yeah. Okay. So I'm a big Mercedes fan, Lewis Hamilton fan when it comes to Formula One. And like passionate, like we're really passionate about it, especially me and my sister. So this just, I feel like it's bonding because you know how families have that little rivalry when it comes to sports? So it's low-key that because my dad isn't a Mercedes supporter exactly, so it makes it extra fun. Yeah, we don't like argue a lot, so I don't know, it kind of makes it fun to argue. I know it sounds weird, but yeah. I'm the type of person, if something means a lot to me, I wouldn't want to wear it a lot because it gets messed up or I don't want it to get dirty. But Every Sunday, you'll find me wearing it when I'm watching Formula One, so especially when I'm watching it. I actually would. I would force my children to wear this, like, kind of like how I was forced to watch Formula One. So same vibes. Hopefully they like it in the end, you know? I don't think I actually have a proper crazy story. I think I had it on the one day and then suddenly I just looked down and there was this white line and I couldn't get it out properly and I almost died inside. I was, I was, yo, I panicked, but I got it out. So yeah, nothing major really. Today we were even saying, yeah, one day when we win the lotto or something, we're gonna buy a, a boat in Monaco and watch the race on the harbour there. Mm. So that's actually one of the things I really want to do in my life. You know? Yes. Stand there on the boats, go crazy. Yes. I don't see myself getting rid of it ever. Like really ever. Because Formula One has kind of always been part of my life as I think about it. Like we had a dog. My first ever dog, my dad named it, named it. <laughs> my dad named the dog Shumi after Michael Schumacher. So it's kind of been a family thing. So yeah. Formula One car, I want to sit in it and I want to drive it. Dad, I'll get to do it, but one day, maybe. I mostly keep up with F1 with like by going through Instagram, like the Formula One Instagram page. That these where you'd get like results and everything, so that's cool. But my favorite, of course, to look at is Lewis Hamilton's Instagram page. He is just a good human in my opinion, and he is my favorite driver. So yeah, I keep up with him a lot there, and as well as Mercedes Instagram page. It's Vibes. Get in there, that's P1, man. Get in there, Lewis. Excellent drive there. Absolutely epic. Nice work, Lewis. Get